And then over the years, I slowly started upgrading versions after moving from 2.5. I think I went 2.6 directly and then went with every major feature release that came up from there as they slowly added features and refined different techniques and truly built out the Cycles render engine from just the Blender engine. And Cycles just got crazy. I remember spending so much time in the node editor. It, it drove me insane. My favorite feature release was 2.7.1 because just... Just look at that. I'm a huge sucker for a good sci-fi image, and that was just, that was perfect. That was about four years after I started using Blender. Uh, and I used 2.7.1 for the longest time and didn't really upgrade until 2.7.9 in late 17. And then kind of sidetracked away from Blender until version 3.0 came out several years later in, yeah, December of 21. And then I really jumped in on version 3.0 because they introduced the EV engine, which just blew cycles out of the water, especially with its real-time rendering. It wasn't perfect, but oh my goodness, it was such a big step. And I slowly kept just working and refining skills up till about 3.2-ish, and then I had a job change and things just got crazy and it just kind of petered out. And I didn't really start using Blender again until version 4 came out in 2023. Uh, and then I used the new EV engine, the new physics rendering. It was, it truly was a phenomenal leap forward, especially in its compute hardware ability. It was awesome. But how in the world are we at 5.0? It's, it's insane how they move so quickly. 